What's up guys? Welcome back to the vlog. Today we are in Austin, Texas on another thrift road trip. I'm so excited. I love these guys. These are my favorite videos to film. Today we are looking for corsets. Guys, I have been trying to manifest a cute corset into my thrift finds and I haven't found one yet. So today is the day. Let's go. Let's start with the shoes. These are so cute. I love a block heel and they're sparkly. Some good boots for fall. I already have so many pairs of black boots. Ooh, some chunky loafers. I don't know what it is about it, but I've been loving like a square toe. Ooh, these would be so perfect for fall. You guys know that like dark red, red is so in and ballet flats. Some more cute loafers. I honestly find Madewell denim pretty often at the thrift and it has always been some of my favorite jeans. Here's some page denim for $10. That's a great deal. They are skinny though. I found a couple pairs of jeans and now I'm gonna look at the sweaters. I don't know. I'm kind of interested in this store. It's a little different. Maybe some cute jackets are hiding in here. That's kind of cute. I like the little mesh. I love the colors of this. Okay, let's go look at the dresses because that's where I always find the most things. We've got Calvin Klein, $12. It's honestly really cute. Just not my color. Okay, I found this dress from Revolve. It's super down and you guys know I love a navy and a one shoulder and a mini. So this is absolutely coming home with me. This Forever 21 dress is actually really cute. I'm not gonna buy it because I don't need any more black, but I really like the shape. Oh, this looks like a good little basic. Ralph Lauren, navy stripes. Okay, I really like the colors of this jacket. I like the fit of it. It looks a little weird with this outfit, but it's super cute. It's too small. Okay, this is that Madewell turtleneck, but I do not like it. I didn't realize it was so boxy and that the sleeves are elastic. This is the Madewell dress and this is so comfy. It's a little wrinkly, obviously, but it fits so well. I love the color and I think it would be so cute for summer. Okay, first store is done. Honestly, I had higher expectations for that store, but that's okay. It leaves more room in the budget <laughs> for the rest of this trip, but I did get one thing. So on to the next. This is a place called Flamingo Vintage in Austin, and they sell things by the pound, which I've never done before. So I'm very excited. Looks like they have lots of things. I think I'm going to find a corset. I'm seeing options so far. Purple's not necessarily my color. This one is gorgeous. Love, don't love the color. This like leather maxi skirt is so cool. Found some Reformation jeans. These pants look so comfy and I love that they're like an off-white cream. These are kind of cool. I like the contrast stitching. There's so many pretty beaded sparkly things. So last year was all about denim maxis, but this year I'm seeing lots of like tailored maxis like this. I kind of like this khaki color. It fits me really well and it's actually a really good length. It's like maxi and not midi. Okay, these are wrinkled, but I really love them. They're so super comfy. I feel like they would be great to wear in like summer or fall. I wanted to love these brown pants, but the zipper is broken and I can't even get it to go down. Thank you. I guess we're in like a vintage shop part of town because right across the street there is some other stores that I did not know about. Oh, you can see them right there. There's like three different ones. So I'm gonna put my bag away and we're going to head across the street. This is a great little brown leather bomber. These are super cool. Little denim boots. Oh my god. I would have died for these. Some vintage guests. Okay, this is the cutest vintage denim mini I've ever seen from the 90s. 35 bucks. obviously have my tank top on, but this is definitely a contender for a corset. These are the leather suede pants and they just kind of fit a little funny, so I don't think I'm gonna get them. Okay, that store was a big success and now I'm headed into this place called Pavement. 
This place has the most sunglasses I've ever seen. Everything is red. Oh, I like these. Guys, why do I kind of like this trucker hat? That was so obviously somebody's like work hat. The colors are good. I've never seen so many shoes in a vintage store. Okay, look at what I just found. I can't tell if they're brown or black, but if they're brown, I kind of like them. Guys, I'm really freaked out because there is crickets everywhere and I can hear them. There's another one. Oh my God, guys, they're everywhere. I literally have to get out of the store. Okay, that place was interesting. There was a lot of stuff there and I feel like I honestly might have found some things if I continued to look but crickets and things that can jump at me just freak me out. The first thing I find is literally the most heavy duty corset ever. This is kind of cute, a little mini dress with this little detail on it. I'll try this on. I love this free people dress. It is really pretty, I'll try it on. This is an amazing find. Very, very cute. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I don't know if I can pull it off, but I love the sleeves. So we're gonna try it on. Okay, this could be interesting. It's like a denim off the shoulder top. This is a perfect sheer layer. Guys, look at what I just found. In my size, $42. Okay, how cute is this little Victoria's Secret top? I was thinking it could be cute as like a swim cover up, but also just like a little skirt. Cute, but too small. And this is like exactly the kind of outfit that I would wear with. This is cute, but it's a little big. I was thinking maybe for the beach. This is kind of cute. It really helps me out in the chest area. I just don't know how often I'd wear it and it's like a stark white which I tend to stay away from. I love H&M smock dresses. I already have one. So pretty. I love the pretty florally print. Now that we refueled with some sweet green, it is time for a haul. The first place we went was the Goodwill Boutique and I only picked up one thing. It was $14.99 and I got the Madewell like little summer dress situation. It has pockets. It's a nice little cottony linen fabric. It'll be great for summer and warm weather. We're constantly going down to the beach in the winter, so I get so much use out of my summer pieces. And then next, we went to Flamingo Vintage, the buy by the pound type thing. And I got two things. I got these cream colored like trouser pants that I showed you. These were so good. And they are silk and cotton, which I just think is amazing. I'm very picky about how my tailored pants fit me and I really liked these. I also got that khaki maxi skirt. I'm so excited to style this for fall. I feel like this is so on trend and it fit me really, really well. So I'm excited. I have no idea what I spent there. I think I spent like $23 or something for both of these things. So not a bad deal. I will say I was a little less impressed or a lot less impressed impressed with Austin's thrift slash vintage scene than I was with Dallas, but I think that's just because Dallas was like a dream. Like it was better than I could have ever asked for. Every single time I'm in Dallas now, I will be thrifting. Next, I went to, what is this place called? Leopard Lounge and I got two things. I got the brown corset top. I am so excited that I finally got one. We manifested a corset. It's brown, it's perfect, it fits great. I'm so excited to style it like by itself and also just like over things. I just think corsets are so freaking cute. I cannot wait to wear it. And it was only 20 bucks. And then also from the Leopard Lounge, I got this little ring. I just think these little like bubble rings are so in right now. It's like, it's very simple, but the size and the shape of it gives it a little bit of a fun detail. So cute. I got this for $13. And then we stopped by Pavement Vintage, which probably had some gems in there, but I got freaked out by the sounds of the crickets and I just like couldn't, I couldn't ignore it. And then I just got thinking like, oh my God, crickets are gonna just like jump on me. I don't like things that can hop at me. But I did get two things before I ran out of the store. I got this brown trucker hat. It says <laughs> Mr. Natural juice bar. I don't know if this is somebody's old workout or what, but I liked the colors of it and I've been wanting like a trucker style hat. So I got it. And then I also got this pair of sunnies. I love them. I love the shape. The hat was $13.95 and I believe the glasses were 
12. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and coming thrifting with me in Austin. I've had so much fun on this little Texas thrift trip. You will definitely have to subscribe to see the rest of the videos on this thrift trip series. The channel has been growing so, so, so quickly. So I just want to say thank you to all the new subscribers and my old subscribers that have supported me for so long. I love you all and I will see you in the next one. Bye.